All right, so yeah, here we are at the brand new chipper body on a new Dodge 5500 for for Zach here, uh, Twin Oaks Tree Care. So yeah, it's a very standard unit, very nice unit. It's got a lot of bells and whistles on it. So got your cabinet here. Your uh, got a pull tray here for your bar saws on or whatever you want. These are lock-in, lock-out trays. Up here we got a pull-out. Hang all your ropes and harnesses off there. Um, yeah, a little toolbox down here. Fully sealed door vented for your fuel. Uh, we got wheel chocks here. Uh, at the back here, slippery. <laughs> back here we got a cone holder on each side of the hitch plate. So you can store your cones on there. Uh, steps on both sides here, so you can you can very easily climb up here. Step in the recess of the tailgate. Get right up top here. Ladder rack on top, strobe lights up here. Yeah, so we do it two different ways. On this one here, we put the lights on top. Uh, the reason for that is uh, the shoot on Zach's chipper was quite high. So putting the lights on top gives more clearance for the chips to come in. Also puts the lights up out of the uh, danger zone. So hopefully the lights get to uh, last a little longer before they get a chip flying into them. Yeah, standard hitch plate at the back to pull your chipper, obviously. Uh, stainless steel. Cam locks on the barn doors, heavy duty aluminum hinges. Uh, and then on this side here, you got your kind of got your sealed pruner box. Again, this pruner box is vented, so if you want to put you know some little saws in here or whatever, that's fine. Uh, pull saw storage up here. Down here, we've got all little dividers for your different gear, so you can put some smaller gear in here. And when you're dumping, it doesn't all slide to the back, so it kind of keeps things neat and tidy, organized. And then on this side of the cabinet, yeah, just some more shelves for some more, yeah, whatever tool or rigging or bar saws. At the top here, you can actually put your shovels and rakes in with the handle and they'll stick right through, through to the far side. So on these chip trucks, it's always hard to find a good spot for your shovels or rakes or brooms so th they can slide right in there. Our own uh, grip set running boards as well, so a bit more grippy than your factory running boards. Got big holes for the mud and snow to go through. And then on the front here, if you want to come around to the front, Mark. So Zach had a electric winch on his old truck, so we moved it over to his new truck. So custom made uh, mounting there for the winch. Custom designed some brackets to mount that right to the frame of the truck. Uh, yeah, just for recovery or pull the odd log out of the bush, I guess. We've got strobe lights in the front grill as well, nicely hidden back in there. So, yeah, that's about it. A nice, uh, a nice unit here.